Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. We got my good buddy Paul over hey there guys. again. Um, we're gonna do us another derby today, another crappie derby between us. We're gonna go out. We're gonna see who can uh, the five biggest and biggest one overall. I think biggest right. Overall, yes, yeah, sir. we're gonna weigh the biggest one too, and we're gonna weigh all five. We're gonna catch them, keep them in our live well alive. If we see anything that's looking puny, we gotta throw it back. We can't keep it. Cause we're not weighing no dead fish in. This no. is a catch and release tournament, so uh, we've all we got plenty of fish, and uh, so we're not going to be keeping any. And um, I don't know if y'all seen the other video we did with uh, t uh, tournament we had between us a few days ago. Paul put it on me hard. I, I mean, he whooped me bad. But guess what? Look, I ain't gonna lie to you. Last time we fished, man, I whooped him so bad. Hey, he put he packed all his toys up and went home early. Mowed the yard. That, it said he wanted to mow the grass yeah. and chose to mow the grass and we needed we're going fishing. Now what do you think? I don't know what to think about that. But anyway, that's what he did. So if you hadn't checked that video out already, the other one where he whooped me bad, go ahead and look at that. If you hadn't subscribed already, please do that. We appreciate your support and we're going to get after it and hopefully show you some good crop fishing. Y'all stay with us. I'm going to try this big heavy one here to begin with. I got a half ounce on. Do you really? Yeah, half ounce homemade head there. I think I'll get down there in a hurry. Yeah. Well, I thought that, you know, the way the wind was blowing, I thought, boy, I better put something on heavy, but it's it's laying pretty good now. I may have a chance. I've got my forward range on 30 foot. Um, just my preference. Um, I seem to do better if it's in between 30 and 25, maybe even 20. I know some folks will uh, zoom it in. The uh, closer they get to the fish, they'll zoom it in a little more. I, don't, I haven't been doing that. I kind of like mine to stay out there a little bit. Everybody got their own preference. I got the gain on 69% right now. We'll see <clears throat> if I have to adjust it at all. Sometimes every day is a little different. You have to kind of fool with it to be able to see them a little better. And also adjust a different color palette um, whatever color you like the best whatever you can see the best I want y'all look at that big tree there lots of fish in that tree they are all in it look at I don't know if y'all can see them crappie but they are thick in it we're gonna we're gonna catch them right here start our, our limit right here Look at that. Oh my goodness. There are crappies in there like you would believe. Oh, it looks like there might be a big largemouth in there too. Look at this boat is set up. I don't know. If it don't spook them all, it may spook them. Look at there. I got something looking at it already. see a good one sitting right in the top of this thing but it could be a large mouth I guess Are they in a yeah you know how it is they're, they're kind of hard to see uh oh uh oh uh oh, uh -oh Paul Paul look out buddy what a struck first Woo, Lord. Oh, it's strict, though, isn't yeah oh no oh man that's what I give her opening my big mouth did you see how big that one was? Yeah, it was nice, wasn't it? Yeah, it. Get away from me. You over here trying to snipe my fish. I see, that one on the I see all of them. Get out of here. There's one on that pole timber. Get out. Get out. Get out of here. There's one in that thing right there. I know where he is. Daggummit. Come over here screwing around with me and mess me up. That one weighed a pound and a half easy. Dang. 
one. I'm going to get out of here. Come in here trying to hold jump me. That gummit make me lose my fish. And then look at him, just drove right over the top of my brush and everything. Blow his trolling motor all in my bush. Dang. No, he did not hit it good. It was just a light bite. Really? Yeah, I kind of think that's why I didn't have him hooked very well. Whoa, you got him? Golly, shoot. Man, you come over here and knock mine off, and then I ain't even close to you to get yours. Oh, that little old peewee thing, I thought you had one. Dang, gun. One of mine will make up for two of them, so that's okay. They don't like this chartreuse one very well. Try my old red and blue and white here. They're in this, uh, this cedar too, dude. That's how this this one is. You know, there's just a a lot of them in it. It's just uh, more than there was the other yeah, way more than there was a few days ago for sure. Oh, that gummit! He bit me, and then I got it hung up. Oh, I got it loose. I got that one. Pull my drag loose. Yeah. Woo. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like I told you, mine. One of mine's bigger than two of yours together. I gotta get some water in this live well. I guess I didn't think I was gonna catch any. I didn't even put the plug in. I don't have no coal beam. If I do catch my five, how am I going to call them? Just look at them, I guess. Now, you've had it now, buddy. I got warmed up. I'm ready. They're looking at it, but they... Uh, just turn away most of them oh that one didn't we'll end up coloring this one I'm pretty sure he's he's not as good as that other one hey you just mind your own business over there Between, there's several all up and down through it, but the ones I've caught have been between around a 12 foot mark, I guess. But if you look down in that tree, if y'all can see that, there's fish, crappie, all in it. Just a matter of getting them to bite our stuff here. Let's see here. We may have to add a little. A little stink to it, maybe. 
Paul religiously uses these nibbles. He don't use this kind. I think he uses regular Berkeley. But I mean, he don't go fishing without putting one on there. Now, I'm not so... I use them, but not near as many as he does. That one wanted it though, didn't he? Yeah, ooh, big girl. Big girl and got it. We won't try to lose that one. We'll try to catch it. Oh, golly, that fish is strong. We got company. We got company. Yeah, boy, a big catfish. That one was a little deeper down in there. Uh oh. I may have scared that one off. Yeah, shrimpy. Baby. That's four. Huh? No, you ain't. One and a catfish don't count. I got him at time. Another big crop. Another big girl. I know I got one in there that needs to come out. It's too too little. And it ain't that one. I think it's this one right there. Yeah. Okay. I think we got two that's two pounds. I don't know, we'll have to see.
What you got, man? No drink? Oh, shrimp? I ain't even going to, this is a good keeper here. I ain't even going to put him close to mine because I don't believe he's going to help any. 12 inch buddy just throwed it back. Without even looking in the live well. You ain't supposed to have a five. Right on the top of that tree, right over here is one. Right. Oh. Almost had him. Right, I did get. I did get dead. Come on, you ready to weigh them? You just come on with it. I said, you ready to weigh them? You just come on with it. Let me check this one. I'll check it. I don't believe you are. If you're ready to put the cards on the table, let's do it. No, that ain't no bigger. Oh yeah, he's gonna cover this one. I think he's gonna cover this one here. Oh yeah, what a good upgrade. Good upgrade. Joker come out of nowhere and snatch that thing. There's another real good one right there too. It's right down there. Coming at us. Knock that one in. Paul didn't even hear me. He right here by me. Got the wind blowing, so he didn't even know it. Okay. Oh, let's see here. And this one is definitely bigger than that one.
Three and one. Bacon. You may get him. You ready to weigh him? Come on, dude. Yeah. Come on. No, we're not changing the rules now. And I done told back at 10. Oh, come on. Look at that flag. You ain't even got your limit yet. Yeah. You got to be culling. You can't have no more than five in the boat at a time. Oh, I'm over five. Oh, you better get busy and get rid of them. It's five fish limit. That's what you got to go do. That's what I've been doing. You got to look at them and say, okay, which one's the biggest, which one ain't the biggest. Oh, he hit it and I didn't get him. I don't know. I about forgot how to do this, I guess. Stole my daggum candy off there too. And thieving sons of guns. And that was about a two and a half, three pounder, I believe. I don't know how they can nibble on it like that so quickly and me not get them. Man, this one moved over here to another stick. I, it is about three pounds, probably. I just seen it go eat a shad. Broke your string? Or no, you had to have the same thing as me, huh? Pulled it away from him, that's what I did. This one is too, boy. It was big and he come back second time for it. Woo, lordy, look at him. Big he is. Don't you wish you had him in your bag? Look at here, look. Another 12 inch is fixing to just look. Oh, look, I ain't even looking in the live well. There he went back. I didn't even check to see if he was going to call. That ought to tell you something right there, buddy. You better quit, you better quit playing with them peewees and get your big boy britches on. Oh, you ready to weigh him? You ready to weigh him? Come on. Let's weigh him. Whenever you're ready, I'm ready. We can do it and eat our lunch and then go catfishing. No, nah, I don't know about no dang bass. Paul, always trying to, always trying to go bass fishing. Yeah, about a half a pound looks like. That's my cool, 
other one. I think it will. I think so. And then it's going to start getting difficult. Oh, canker bridges here. Oh, yeah. A lot bigger than that, that one. All right, guys, we're at stop number two. To catch some begging. Paul's just trying his best to catch up. He's moving us all over. I've been waiting. I just heard there's a fish right here. I've been ready to weigh mine for about two hours, hold and he on, hold on, hold on. he he just says, "Well, let's keep on, let's keep on." He just wants to keep weighing them or keep fishing until he beats me. I got one spotted. I'll get him. Y'all see him pull up on me over there a while ago and get right on top of my brush. I'm gonna. I'm going to do the same thing to him. I'm going to snipe a fish right out from under him. Is that in shallow, Paul? Because I see something shallow. Oh, I see one down there on the side of that tree. I'll get him for you, Paul. Large mouth, baby! Uh. Big bass, boy, big bass. You just wish you could catch a, catch a bass like this, don't you? Yeah, do. Come on. You look at him. He's, in, he's even too embarrassed to look. I seen that rascal sitting on the top of a tree. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, what you got? Catfish! Catfish Charlie! Uh oh, buddy! You ready to weigh him? Yeah, I'm ready now. Let's weigh him! Oh my gosh! He's strong, ain't he? Woo! Ooh, it is a good one! Big old girl! She might weigh half a pound. And then pole's too long, ain't it? Oh. There you go. He finally got him one. Labrador. Finally got him one. Oh, he's going to wear. He, he better start cuddling. Two pounds. Well, you finally got one to put in the basket. What do I have? Catfish? Hey, damn it. Look at this guy. Ran through the middle of the trees. <laughs> no. Look at I got a catfish. If that was me, I'd have tore my boat to pieces. Look at here. Oh, nasty thing. And more trees didn't bother him none, buddy. He's going. He's chasing a bass down.
Another goon? No, uh, it hooked me down deep. Yeah, it hooked me down deep. And I didn't, that's a big one, isn't it? It's a decent one. Golly, the thing got hooked in the net. How do we tell the difference? I'm having a hard time now, Paul. Holy, that one looks thicker. Dang it. Dang it, I can't tell. I'm going to take a chance. I took a chance. I just couldn't tell. What's what? You have to get us a coal beam. Let's say 30 more minutes. Three o'clock. Huh? Central. Three o'clock. And then we'll weigh them and then I'm going catfishing. Or, uh, right now, whatever this is. Alright. We're about to call this and our derby's about over. We said we was gonna fish till three o'clock. We got 259 right there. Paul's trying to get all he can, trying to milk this for all. I was ready to weigh in at noon. And he just keeps on, keeps on, keeps on. Hey, no, no, let's go over here. Let's, let's go over here. Just trying to beat me. Trying to beat me. No, it's over. You can't, you don't have enough time to land him now. No way. And y'all missed it. He come up here and sniped one out from underneath me. I was taking my shirt off because I was so freaking burning up hot and then he ended up losing it. That's what he gets for coming up here snagging one out from underneath. Uh, three o'clock! Lines out! Lines out! We got to see what we got. We got to get them back in the lake. Bring your boat up here so we can make sure you ain't cheating. He likes to do some cheating, man. That sucker will bring minnows on you, slip them in. Then he'll come up and steal a fish off a of spot you fishing on. I'm jigging today, though. I'm going to turn this thing off so it don't burn this battery up. I'm ready. I got mine ready. And he was supposed to be culling the whole time. And I think he's got all of them in there. I'm going to weigh them No, back. you can't weigh them all. you got to pick your five and put them in there. And that's the way it's going to be. You can't be saying, no, let's weigh this one. Let's weigh this one. Five biggest. Your five biggest out of there. Here, get the drum. Jog us up or something. No, you can't weigh the drum. You should be able to get right over here. I mean, it's not going to hurt your boat if we hit it. If I break that, power, that pole off. I don't want to do that. That's probably okay. I got to be, he's got to be close enough so I can see the scale. He's liable to tell me it weighs 14 pounds. Keeper. That's not a keeper. 
Uh oh, he done. He called one. Throw it. Let us look at you, a few of your calls. Uh oh, what is that about a pound and a quarter? Two pounder. Oh, come on. That's a call. Oh gosh, I wouldn't even even put I wouldn't even live scope that one. I don't want to throw too many back. No, you gotta keep five and you may only have about six in there. See, how, look how much, how far your boat drifted off. I know. I think the coronavirus is messing with our GPS. Okay, a cold black. That was a pretty good sized black crappie. Oh, oh a cold white crappie, and she's pretty good size too. No, that's not a cold. Oh, it ain't? No. Oh, I thought you was fixing to throw her back. She's getting slime everywhere. Yeah, let her go back. That'll be good. Put them in the basket. Coal. Another coal weighs about a pound, maybe. Okay, I think I got them. You got them? All right. I'm gonna slip the gas for goo in. No, the goo. Ah. Keep a goo though. Don't throw him out. Here, slide. you're going to slide up here to where I can see. Okay. Let's see what these things go. Here, matter of fact, we could have tied your rope over here. See that thing. We need to hook that deal on there next time and make it stay permanent. You know what? Yeah. Sorry, scale. Okay, hold it. Don't drop your whole net in the lake. What's the matter? Not, Not well, zeroing out? Yeah, okay, here we go. Six eight five zero. Eight five zero. All righty. Let them rascals go. There they go. Go, copies. There they take off. Get on down there, boy. He just don't know he's loose yet. Go, crappy. Neither does that. One. There. We may have to eat a couple of them. No, he, there he goes. He didn't even know he was free, did he? Yeah. Okay. Okay. He's over here, and let me have that. We'll try. Oh, I'll fine. 850. I need to throw in my gas for goo. We'll use your net because it's the same weight. Uh oh. Here, get over here close. Okay. Here, here you go, you need this. Alright. Let's see what he's got. Bunch of one. small one. <laughs> There's two. Come on, here. Here's three. Decent size. Here's four. Decent size. That one. It's gonna be close. <laughs> <laughs>
Mine was uh, round up to nine. Ten eleven, baby. <laughs> Hold on. Ten eleven. Locked on ten eleven. Woohoo! I thought I saw a nine in there. <laughs> no, locked on ten eleven, baby. Come feel this whole sack. Golly, that is a big group of crappies. Oh, and get, get there woke. they go. Get woke up, girl. Awesome. We may have to eat that one. She's acting skinny. Yeah, there she goes. Alright, hand me this. Awesome. Yeah, look at there. It's, it's locked on it. On 1011? Yeah. Got it. Got it. Alright, guys. Well, that's going to conclude today's crappie fishing. We hope you enjoyed it. Uh, for Paul and myself, thanks for watching. Yeah, Hit the I appreciate, yeah. appreciate it, guys. Hit the subscribe button if you hadn't already, and we'll see you on the next one. Thank you all for joining us.